In a few minutes on Granada, what's my line with Angela Rippon after the Northwest News? Hello, good afternoon. The Northwest News so far today, it's just after five to three. Health Secretary Kenneth Clark is in Manchester this afternoon to hear the North West's reaction to the government shake-up of the health service. He'll be talking to health managers from across the region. Meanwhile, members of one authority are going overseas to learn new methods of patient care in preparation for the changes. Two senior doctors and the general manager of North Manchester Health Authority set off on Sunday for a trip which will take in Japan, New Zealand, Canada and the United States. The bills being footed from prize money won by the authority in a national health efficiency competition. But the management team says the timing couldn't have been better. We started to organise this trip now about four to five months ago, but I think the main point of interest is, is now really how relevant that is, given the white paper which has been launched um, this week. And many of the features that we are planning to study are in fact of vital elements of Kenneth Clark's white paper. A taxi driver is seriously ill in the Countess of Chester Hospital after a road crash on the busy A41 on the outskirts of the city. The driver, who hasn't been named, was trapped in the car for more than an hour after the collision with a lorry at Crystleton. Construction workers at the Drig Nuclear Waste Dump in Cumbria have abandoned their strike over safety. Forty workers walked out on Wednesday after staging a four-day sit-in, claiming they aren't sufficiently protected. They're now demanding showers and changes of clothing, but have returned to work while pressing for a visit from the Nuclear Installations Inspectorate. 120 workers at the Heinz Bait Bean Factory in Wigan face suspension tonight over a dispute involving shift patterns. This morning, the dispute led to more than 100 workers being suspended when they finished the night shift. Management says production at the plant, which is the largest in Britain, has not been affected. At the Heysel disaster trial in Brussels, the lawyer representing one of the Liverpool soccer fans has told the court that video evidence proves his client's innocence rather than his guilt. The solicitor for John Davis from Prescott on Merseyside has claimed the video of the riot confuses his client with another fan. Industry Minister Robert Atkins has urged businesses in Lancashire to prepare to meet the challenge of the single European market. He's been speaking in Leyland at the opening of a business exhibition involving 40 companies. Now look at the weather for the rest of the afternoon. It's going to stay overcast for much of the region without breaks of drizzle, so take a brolly. Still quite mild though, temperatures reaching a high of 11 degrees centigrade. That's 52 Fahrenheit, if I've got my maths right. That's the news so far. We're back with an update in around half an hour. Till then from me, good afternoon to you. This afternoon's film on four in a couple of minutes is Tall Target, starring Dick Powell. Here on Granada we have more occupational hazards for the panel to deduce on What's My Line? to welcome you to What's My Line, not just you, the audience, but also, of course, our four panellists. Let's say hi to them, starting with that wizard from the football pitch, Garth Crooks. <laughs> A lady who is so talented, only two words could possibly describe her, Faith Brown. Oh, thank you. Nice. <laughs> you want talent? You've got Jilly Cooper. Oh. Presenter, DJ, heartthrob, Philip Schofield. <laughs> well, that's the team. Let's meet the first of our contestants. Will you sign in, please? Paul, oh, welcome. Give us your mind, please. Thank you, Paul. Right, while well, they pick the bones out of that, come and make yourself comfortable. And if you want to play the game at home, this is where you close your eyes, because coming up on the screen is what Paul Barrett does for a living. <laughs> now, Paul comes from Middlesex. He's self-employed. And, Garth, we start with you. Hello, Paul. 
Um, right. Uh, is what you do, is it, is it salaried? Um, he's self-employed. I'm beg your pardon, self-employed, mm. fine. Um, <coughs> would I, would you come to my house to, 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 to perform this duty? Yes. Mm -hmm. You are good at this, aren't you? Yes, no. I hate him. <laughs> Stab, stab. Um, we're going to see how good I am now when I, I'm stuck. Uh, are you, does it involve a uniform? Yes. Right. Run over me. Is it a uniform? Uniform protected. It's not a uniform, is it? Oh. It's not. Oh. It's not a uniform that he wears. Faith Brown. Uh, hi, Paul. Hi. You're very handsome. Is that anything to do with it? Oh, no, 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 that wasn't quite... No, no, no. It's I a milkman. It's a milkman. Do you have a, a special tool? <laughs> no, no, no. I mean... No, do you have... I mean, do you have a... My no, I rephrased that one. Do, do you have a special tool or tools to use yeah. when you do this? Yeah. He does use special equipment. You do yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm there to I'm sorry, Angela. I'm new at this. He's been out a long time. I'm new at this man. Right, uh, special, yes. Uh, now, we've established, have we established it? It's indoors, yes. We have established mm. it's indoors. Um, yeah, you come, you would come to my house. Now, if I wasn't doing what I'm doing at the moment, like sort of in the business, in this business now, could I do what you do? Do you think I could? Yes. Oh, I could. I'd quite like to have you along, actually, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I could do it. Now you've stopped me now. Um, uh, uh, could I find you in the Yellow Pages? Yes. I could find you in the Yellow Pages. <laughs> Darling, you could find me in the Yellow Pages. Just look for me under the section Brides, you know what I mean? <laughs> sorry about that. I just thought... Uh, no, no, no. I know. Sorry, no, no, no. Um, uh, so do you so, 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 do you come into contact with the phys uh, physical contact with the public, the general public? No, no, no he, he doesn't. doesn't. No, Chilly. No. Hello. Hello. So you come to my house with your special tool. <laughs> Chilly. <laughs> now, um, now we must. Say, I was worried about Angela. Angela got a bit iffy about uniform. And, 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 and what, what, you obviously wear something to do with this, though. Is, are you protecting yourself when you... When you yes. Yes, it's protective clothing rather than a uniform. So he comes to my house to do something vaguely dirty or keep your... You know, keep your feet. <laughs> well, I have a septic tank, but I live in the country. You don't do anything with septic tanks, do you? Sometimes, yeah. Uh, well, things. <laughs> sometimes. He does sometimes. I mean, but, but are you a, I mean, you, do, do you unblock? Are you a plumber? I'm not a plumber. No, he's not a plumber. Philip Schofield? Not a plumber. So, um, it is to do mostly with water. Yeah. And if I was to... If I was to, if I was to say, that, uh, most of your work would involve water. Yes. Um, would I be on the right lines if I said I'm blocking? Yes. <laughs> Quite important. Uh, careful. 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 Yeah. Yeah. It's got anything to do with with drains. Has got something to do. Would you like to say what it says on what, the card? What it says on the card? No, actually, I don't. You sort of said it. Guessing a drain unblocker. <laughs> right. Yes, he does. <laughs> what, it, what it actually says on the card is that Paul Barrett is a drain cleaner, but he unblocks uh, them oh, as well. Right, right. And in fact, not just the kind of drains that we would have in our homes at all, is it, Paul? You you do kind of whopping great things, do? Yeah, yeah, in commercial, industrial, uh, all types of drain. I may, mainly do uh, high pressure water jetting. I'm awfully sorry you didn't beat the panel, but no. it was a pleasure to have you on the programme, and maybe one day you will actually go and look after Jilly's septic tank.
A drain unblocker he was. Right, shall we ask our next contestant to sign in, please? Jeffrey, your mind, please. Come on. Very intricate little line there. Jeffrey, come and sit down. Right, coming up on your screens now is what Jeffrey does for a living. your screens I can tell you that Jeffrey comes from Maidenhead in Barks he is free fee earning <laughs> and Faith Brown we start with you Stop. hello Jeff hello Jeffrey yes you're terribly terribly yes I love the signature has mm -hmm. that got anything to do with what you do <laughs> that has got something to do with what you do but you look so terribly you know uh, yes, Latin is the right word. Yes, it's very Latin. Isn't it? um, <laughs> now, could I do with what? Could I do what you do? Do you think? You could, yes. Yes. So it take. Does it take training to do what you do? Yes. It does take a fair amount. So I couldn't do it really. You know what I mean? No, no, no. Um, oh yes, yes. I don't believe this. I'm getting yeses. Um, um, oh God. Uh, yes. Jilly's just asked me to say, do I, do you provide a service? No. Thank you very much, Jilly. <laughs> How would you like a teeth of the necklace, Jilly? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm Jilly sorry. Hoover. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, do, 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 is there an end product? Yes, there is. There is. Um, and, and the writing is something to do with it. So you don't, you're not a, um, ugh. Is that anything? To, is writing anything to do with the end product? No. No, it isn't. But the, can look, the nope. one, Philip. Um, is your occupation artistic in it? Um, in uh, maybe design of some sort? No. No, no, I believe them, they clapped. <laughs> They're going by them. <laughs> They're wrong. <laughs> Not designed, no, Garth. I have to say, you obviously you dress very well. Um, Thank you. And um, would I be right in saying that you, 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 you pay attention to detail? Yes. Hmm. You pay attention to detail. I'm no better off for that question. <laughs> <laughs> but don't you love the intense way he asks? I do. Yes. I do yes. Artistic signature. Do you paint? No. No, he doesn't paint. Oh. Faith. I'm going to get a no, I know. Jeff, drawing? Anything to do with... <laughs> drawing. <laughs> drawing. Drawing. Um, now then. Could I ask you to come, could you do uh, oh, yeah. a sketch like uh, for buildings or like uh, nothing to do? No. Nothing to, no, no, no. nothing to do with that. Jilly Cooper. Um, there's, a, there's an end product mm. we've had established, that, haven't we? Mm. Um, and you draw. Um, do people buy what you draw in a shop? Sometimes they can. Sometimes they can. But not always. Not always. So, no. in fact, people might um, commission you privately to do the, what you do. Yes. They do. And you draw. And so, I mean, is, are we as getting too complicated? I mean, is he an artist? Yes, he's that. But he's something very specific. Specific. So you paint particular things. Or, 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 is it on the card? Is, is artist on the card? Not on the card. No. 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 I'm going to give you a no for that and start to hurry because artist is not no. on the card. Yeah. Philip. Um, so you draw. Um, or you are, you, if you said draw, don't say no, because you've got, I've got an ear drawing. <laughs> um, so it is drawing up to, a, a, of a, of a sort. Um, so is it, is it, uh, oh gosh, it's do you, do you, is it technical drawing? No. No, it isn't, and I'm going to really have to put the chasers right. on you, Garth. It's a specific type of drawing. Yes. 
artistic. Yes. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Um, you like like caricature. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh no. He's not known as a caricaturist. No. no. You, I, I have to go by what he says. Faith, and I'm really going to have to worry right, now. I just ask a cartoon. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Jeffrey Markley, actually professionally known as Goff. You might have well have seen his work in Punch. And in fact, we yes. can have a look at some of the things that he does, which include <laughs> wonderful Christmas cards and things yes, like that. Yes, cards, some cards to children's television. And in yeah. fact, if you watch a new children's television program called Playbus, you will be able to see not the whole of Jeffrey, no, no. but his hands at work. Just the hands. Oh, he will be me. the hands. I'm sorry you didn't meet the panel, but That's thank right. you for being on. I'm delighted we got a chance to look at your work. You do stay with us, won't you? We just have to go away just for a couple of minutes, but we will be back in just a moment with today's mystery celebrity. Join us then.